The Rubik's Cube has 43 quintillion possible combinations. You ever think about how the inventors solved it for the first time? Me too. So this guy, Erno Rubik, is born in Budapest, Hungary. And in 1974, he's 30 years old. He's a novice professor teaching design and architecture. But it was weird because he was like kind of the same age as his students. So he wanted to find cool new ways to teach them, especially about three dimensions. So he gets to tinkering on this new teaching aid, a cube with six different colors on each side and 26 smaller cubes that rotate about the center. He brings it to class and is like, well, we must find a method to solve it. And the students are like, bro, there's a problem. The little cube within the larger cube, they all have different rules and there's f***ing 43 quintillion possibilities. But Erno's a dog. So he takes the cube home and just stares at it for a month until he cracks the code and solves his cube. He creates algorithms, rules to solve the cube, and releases it to the world in 1980 as a toy, one of the most successful of all time.